This is Red Feather from Grepax. In this Kadian Live video, we will be showing you how to enhance white noise or other unwanted noise for removal using Audacity. I have temporarily removed the video portion of this video for ease of editing the audio in on the Kadian Live timeline. Also, I have already added my gain effects and razor tooled the portion of the audio white noise we will be trying to enhance for Odyssey. The purpose of doing this is Audacity uses a profile of the noise you would like to remove. The bigger the profile, the easier it is for Audacity to remove it. Once you have made any and all of these adjustments with your Acadian Live audio, take the back portion of the audio, moving it to the right on the timeline in order to make room. Right click on the noise you would like to, to remove on the Kadian Live timeline, scroll down to copy and click. Go to an empty section of the timeline to the right, right click and scroll down to paste and click. You can paste as many times as you need to on the Kadian Live timeline depending upon the size of the copy and paste so as to get a good size profile for the Audacity sound reduction tool. Once this is done in Kadian Live, replace the video portion and render in Kadian Live. Once your render is finished, close out of Kadian Live. Then, open Audacity. Go to File, scroll down to Open, and click. Navigate to the area your Kadian Live video was saved to, highlight it, and click Open. This will extract the audio. Once your audio appears on the Audacity timeline, play the audio so as to assure yourself where the noise that you built up in Kadian Live for the profile is. Test one, two, three, test. Test one, two, three, test. Test one, two, three, test. Test one, two, three, test, test. This is Red Feather from Grepax. Go to the area on the Audacity timeline where the noise buildup is and highlight it. Then go to the Audacity effects list, scroll down to noise reduction and click. Then once the noise reduction window appears, click get profile. Once Audacity has finished collecting the profile, on your keyboard click CTRL and the letter A. By using this keyboard shortcut, it assures that all of your video is highlighted in order for Audacity to remove or reduce whatever the noise is throughout the whole audio. You may need to run the, this noise reduction in Audacity more than once in order to get the proper results needed. The good thing is, once Audacity has the profile, it has it. So after running the Audacity reduction once, and you have seen the noise reduce some, click the CTRL key and then A on your keyboard once again. Go to the effects list 
of Odyssey. Scroll down to Noise Reduction and click. Once the Noise re Reduction window appears, click OK. Repeat this process in Audacity until you receive the results you are looking for. Notice on my Audacity timeline, it looks as though it has removed all of the white noise. Test one, two, three, test. Test one, two, three, test. Test one, two, three, test, test. This is Red Feather from Grepax. And sounds like it has as well. Once you are happy with the process of the noise reduction, give it a playback. To make sure, if you are still happy, go to File, scroll down to Export, then scroll down to Export as a Wave, and click. Name your WAV file, and choose the destination you would like to save it in. And then click Save. This next window in Audacity gives you the opportunity to fill out different information about your audio. This is not mandatory, so add what you like, and then click OK. Once this is done, close out of Audacity, open up Kdn Live, bring your WAV file and video into Kdn Live, replace the new adjusted audio with the old, and then render. I hope you have enjoyed this video and found it helpful in some fashion, and if so, then why not give this video a like? And while you're at it, why not become a subscriber? I mean, after all, it is free. The intro and extra of this video has been provided by none other than Alex Abayu one from his YouTube channel. Thank you in advance. I am out.